All right, so for those who weren't here last time, this is Tales of Vesperia. We are currently in a rundown city that was destroyed somehow. We're not exactly sure why it was destroyed or how it was destroyed, but it was. We also found this nice little hidden door that's tightly shut, and we found three pieces of parchment that have, say, a password to this door. So we're investigating it. Also, our characters became a bit sick when we first hit this level. All of the green stuff floating up around us, that is condensed air or magic. So not A-I-R, A-E-R in this world is magic. So yeah, and that's what we're doing. You're all cut out. No extra input in codes, please enter the password. Oh, jeez. Wait. I have three pieces of paper. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten slots? I have three pieces of paper. Huh. Okay. Uh, yeah, DJ. Next answered it. You were, you were, so, question of the day, DJ, is your question, so you should be familiar with it. And next was talking about having crossovers or crossovers. And it's, it's a really cool idea. It is. Super ambitious. Okay, we need to look at our items. Valuables. Here we go. Password clue one. A research note found the word light is written on it, the word sky is written on it, and the word sphere is written on it. Light, sky, sphere. Light, sky, fear, sphere. My first thought is the sun, right? It's something that produces light, it's in the sky, and it's a circle. It's a sphere, right? It's a ball. So my first thought is that they're talking about the sun. Maybe star says next? Yeah. Sure, let's try star out first. So maybe we don't actually have to use all of the spaces. Maybe they're there to throw you off. Oops. Um, backspace is Y. Okay. Nope, not star. Can I try sun this time? I wonder if uppercase versus lowercase matters. It was sun. Did you hear the little jingle? There it is. A moon was that. That'd be our my next guess. Yeah, next. You feel scammed. <laughs> You're good. Bam! Did you really lose five k just now, dude? You, you gotta be careful with that, man. You're gonna lose your spot. That water is floating. It looks like that blastia is causing it. And probably this strange feeling as well. Uh, for those who don't know, Blastias are concentrated, like, cores, like crystals of magic that are used to accomplish tasks that people usually couldn't do by themselves, or long tasks, something like that. So a Blastia is basically like a magical source that does things. Panda, welcome in. Unfortunately, you just missed the raid, Panda. Huh. But welcome He's in. similar to the ones at Emmied Hill in Capua Noor. Is it broken? When a Blastia breaks, it loses its ability to take in air. There's no way it would get like this. So, what's going on? I don't know. What could he be trying to do? W was that a monster? 
Oh, that is a monster. Monster! Take it easy. You're not feeling well. And there aren't any doctors around here. Huh? But, but I... The barrier's gonna fail. Don't worry. That's a reverse barrier. A reverse barrier? A reverse barrier? It's a powerful barrier for holding monsters. He won't get out of there anytime soon. Interesting. DJ, I'm doing well. I am. Work was... I mean, it's work. You know what I mean? So, ups and downs. That's whatever. Uh, hung out with the wife right after work. Had some pizza. Chilled with her. And that was nice. And now we're here. So, overall, day's going well. Can't complain. So, yeah. How are you doing, DJ? But the air here... This isn't normal. Oh, for sure, Panda. Yeah, do it. For sure. I would totally love to see that. I got a bad feeling about this. It's starting to disappear. Rita, calm down. I'll have it fixed in no time. I wonder if this is like an optional super hard so boss fight or something. Tyson? So I'm pretty sure that Sorry. guy in the middle. None of us here are nice enough to take your friendly warning seriously. So I think they're all part of the Hunting Blades Guild. So this could get ugly. <laughs> you don't say. Well now, if it isn't that runt Carol who got his sorry butt cut from the team. The air must be affecting him. It looks pretty thick over there. That's just what we want. You won't just sit tight and behave yourselves. Thanks for plugging the Discord, Levi. You sure talk big. Taking care of a pet is a big responsibility, you know. <laughs> Don't I love how sarcastic he is. For someone else to take care of. <gasps> oh look, it's, again. it's the Dragon Rider. Okay, but chat, I'm on the side that. Ooh. Hey, I feel better. The thing that they're calling a dragon is totally not a dragon. It's totally just a shark that's flying. It's a, it's it's a, it's a sky shark. That's all it is. The barrier's down. Of course, that dragon freak broke the blastia. You're dead, freak. Dead. Oh, that's super cute, Panda. Although the thing we're about to fight. Show me some anger. Show me what a monster's like. Now I'm gonna mop the floor with you. So Clint's the leader of this hunting hunting blades guild, a guild just about hunting monsters. So let's see if he can actually take this thing on. Because if anyone in this room can by himself, it's probably him. Huh? Wait. Looks like he wants the first piece of action, Clint. Oh, the dragon rider is defending the monster? It is. Okay, yeah, this thing, that's totally not a dragon. That's a sky shark. Opinions chat. Yeah, that's definitely a sky shark. Damn, if we lose Next, it's a mistranslation for a very good reason. Are you referring to those the Dragon Rider thing next? <laughs> Skyrim mod? <laughs> I've never seen anything you should like Levi. it before. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! I guess we gotta take care of someone else's pet. That sounds awesome, DJ. That sounds really, really cool. Oh wait, I'm fighting it by myself? Why am I fighting this by myself? This seems like a terrible idea. Yeah, this- Oh, hey, okay. We got, we got one more ally in. Good, good. So right there, I was able to combo him a lot because I used an overdrive. The overdrive lets me straight up just combo endlessly. Usually, you only do like three or four hits at a time. Let's see, now that my overdrive's done, he's able to get it. Okay, uh, hey, can you- yeah. Okay, uh, full charge. Please, please get up, Glenn. Sorry, I'm... 
Yeah, yeah Panda, it shows that you worked hard on it. Like, it seemed like awesome, like what you did. Like the, what is that art from, if I may ask? Like, is that your own creation? Or is that a reference to something? Okay, so this is the Dreaded Giant. Has 28,000 HP left. It's resistant to almost, what, four different types of magic, but it's weak to wind and fire type of magic. Interesting. Okay. Weak to fire, eh? Hmm. Okay, how about you don't use an item when you're standing right in front of the beast, Ruby? Come on, bro. And now it's using an overlimit. Oh no, there was totally Fatal Strike there. Oh, that sucks. The Fatal Strike right there, it's, it gives me an opportunity for an instant kill, but I hit the wrong button again. Okay, there it is. Oh, come on. Please get up. Flynn, please get up. We, we totally missed an instant kill. That's sad. Really, I ha I get my overdrive and immediately get knocked down. Okay, here we go, here we go. I missed it again. So whenever that you see that green circle, or sometimes it's blue or purple or uh, red circle comes up. <sighs> you can do an instant kill move. But we got him anyways, so it's fine. It's fine. Turtle <laughs> uh, and Shark Levi? Okay. that are not from this world. Interesting, Next, I had no idea. That's super interesting. That isn't right. That's super cool, Nex. Thank you, the more you know. That's super interesting, I had no idea. Ryu is just a creature from another world. Huh. That's, that's cool. That's cool. We made it. It's a kawaii panda. That's pretty cool, panda. I mean, it makes sense then, because panda, panda, makes sense. What about Carol? There ain't a monster alive that wasn't born to be my punching bag. Master, it's too dangerous. This monster's mine, even if it costs me my life. I feel like that's a terrible decision, but sure. And Rita's gonna throw fireballs? No, she stopped. Yeah! <laughs> that guy just the gets ceiling. thrown off. It's not gonna hold. Chief, we have to withdraw. DJ, the donkey from Shrek Dragon? Are you talking about that's like the dragon you see? We can't afford to stay here now that the mark has escaped. Damn. Hadn't seen a monster like that in a while. What a letdown. Alright, pull out. We should leave, too. It's not fair! I wanted to beat the hell out of that freak, too! Wait, where did Carol go? If he isn't out here, he probably left before us. We'll look for him as we go. Okay, so we don't have Carol anymore. Ha! Okay, next. That's fun. Okay, okay. No worries, GJ. That's okay. That's pretty cool. I had no idea. Ryu. Wait, but isn't Ryu the name of the Street Fighter character who's a martial artist? Is that supposed to be a uh, reference to him as well? Like, not maybe not a reference in this game to that or whatever, but like his name is supposed to be a reference to some, I don't know, greater creature or power that he can harness? I don't really know Street Fighter lore. But that sounds like it could be cool. Oh, it is Dragon? Okay, okay. Wait, Shrek 5? Yeah, I was about to ask Levy. There's, 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 a, there's, a, there's a Shrek 4? When did that happen? Something comes up, and it's just poof, you're gone. Always, always running away by yourself. It's not like that. Oh, Carol did run away. Not like what? Like I said back in Halur, 
I'm not talking about Halur. Yeah, she's talking about right now, dude. If you're not ashamed of anything, then shouldn't you hurry back to your friends? It's just that no need to explain to me. I think you've got other people who'll listen to you. Oh, uh, no worries, Nex. No worries. Huh? Guys. Carol, I'm so glad you're safe. Where the hell did you go? We were really in a jam back there. <laughs> Good job, Rita. I'm I'm sorry. He's a coward. Hey, at least you made it out in one piece. I'm leaving. Wait. Can we kill that girl? You think long and hard about what you've done. Right here. That's all I have to say to you. Hey, cut it out! Let's get going, Carol. We're all tired. It's written as plenty? Interesting. Oh, okay, okay. From Street Fighter, okay. Yuri. Interesting. Man, we were way off. The Blood Alliance was nowhere to be seen. No kidding. We'll have to take any information that guy gives us with a grain of salt. Guy? You don't mean... Yeah, he got that yeah. information from Raven. Oh, I'm gonna roast that deadbeat the moment I see him. Let's... Let's take it easy on the way back. If I take it easy, you mean fight everything we it's see? Not like got I... it. Hey, you're gonna get left behind. I'm coming. Carol okay, rejoined. Okay. <sighs> oh, really? Next, I uh, see. I barely understand English. Grammar for me in general is super hard. So, uh, trying to learn another language is a huge hurdle for me because I'm not good at th my primary language like with grammar and spelling like I just it's not a strong suit like lately I've had to I, I started learning that for my tweets I needed to have someone else proofread it to make sure I didn't make any like little mistakes in spelling or grammar or something usually it's my wife Candace she will proofread it for me but like the other day at work I had one of my co-workers read it for me before I tweeted something out so yeah. Ah, oh, the common rabble. So I've finally found you. That's far enough. Oof, are, are you okay, Bam? Let me know if you're, if you're okay financially, dude. You lackeys must have had a lot of time on your hands if you crossed the ocean just to see us. <laughs> you're in no position to talk down to the likes of me. Uh, little backstory on these guys. Currently, Yuri, the main character, the guy dressed in black who's trying to be as edgy as possible, he's the main character. He escaped from prison in the first city we are in, and he's being chased across literally the world. And these are some guards that are trying to bring him back to prison. He currently has like a $10,000 or 10000 gald bounty on his head, so... Backstory for you. Now, princess, right this way. Huh? What does he mean, princess? Also, we've been wondering why Estelle, the pink hair girl, was important this entire game, and I think we're just now finding out why. The princess standing right here in front of us. Y Yuri, but how did you? What? Estelle's a princess? I suspected as much myself. Rita, you too? Wait, you've got to be kidding. Good, Bam. Okay. Uh, good. I'm glad you'd be okay, Bam. <laughs> Next. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> and what will happen to my friends? Why, they'll be drawn and quartered for abducting a member of the royal family, of course. Please, wait! I wasn't abduct- Ah, oh, what a mouthy young lady you are. This way, please. Ooh, do we get to fight these guys? That'd be fun. Estelle! Now die like the flies you are. Yeah, Yuri just drew his sword. Arrest the culprit Yuri Lowell and his accomplices! <laughs> so this is LeBlanc. You, the Swan Brigade. Just a minute. This prize catches mine. I won't let you take him from me that easily. Catch! 
Our duties are not to be carried out in the fashion of a hunt. <laughs> did I not also hear someone mention dying earlier? You did. What is wrong with condemning criminals to their deaths? Should not criminals be captured and judged in accordance with the laws? <laughs> I suppose I can let you have these little worms. If it isn't Schwan, it's Flynn. These upstart commoners are so full of themselves. Even that commandant. Uh, this way, please, your highness. Do watch your step. Um, but I... Yes, right this way. Interesting. Auto mod caught his name, Kumor. Okay. Arrest them in the name of Captain Schwan. Okay, Yuri Lowell gang, it's curtains for you, I say. What do you mean, gang? Oh. Get your hands off me! Do you know who I am? Yeah, I see that now. Next, totally missed that. Fun times. It's cool, chat. Just start walking. It's cool. Walk, I say. Ow! Hey, watch it with the pulling. Sir Schwan, we shall take these undesirables to Heliord. Are we? Are we not actually fighting any? Why are we fighting back? Ooh, this guy looks cool. All members, fall out. No, we're straight up just being. That was a nice jingle. Also, Estelle just earned the royal successor title. Estelle left the party, but it seems like everyone left the party since we're being thrown in prison. Continuing mark. on, we will review the particulars of your 18th crime. 18th? What? Please do. Is it true that you threw a knight sent to collect the taxes into the river? I mean, maybe. Wow, I'd forgotten about that. Was that you, Tweedle? Ha! <laughs> Pretty much next. Uh, DJ. Uh... Yeah, that should be- that should be next year. I'm excited for this- I'm cautiously optimistic for the Sonic movie. Since they took the time to redo all the animations and all of the graphics in the game- in the game- in the movie about Sonic, I feel like a lot of care is really going into that movie, right? So... I'm cautiously optimistic for that movie. I wouldn't say excited. That's right. Right, I Levi? Was in bed yeah. The cold for three whole days, thanks to you. How many more of these are there? This is getting pretty boring. I wonder what'll happen to me. So I'll write. You have no signs of remorse in the report, then. <laughs> Who's that do-nothing captain of yours anyway? What was his name? Schwan. Playing hooky because he's the big shot. You dare mock our captain. Pretty much. Sir Schwan is a legendary hero and a veteran of the Great War 10 years ago. Hmm. I think this is the first we're hearing about this Great War. So basically, his eminence would never stoop so low as to deal with nobodies like us. Quiet, I say. Quiet. Getting on to your next offense. Your Excellency, Commandant Alexei. To what do we owe this pleasure? Commandant Alexei. That's interesting. Rather than Alexa or Alex, Alexei. I kind of like that. Alexei. What? Apparently Yuri knows Alexei. All your crimes are hereby pardoned by the good graces of their highnesses Esteles and Yoder. Ha! 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 So... Esteliz is Estelle, she's the princess, and Loder is a guy we saved like 30 minutes ago in our playthrough, who is the heir to the throne. Apparently the last king or ruler just died, and there are multiple heirs that they're trying to pick from. Loder is one of those heirs. So between them, they probably have a ton of pool. That's hilarious. What? But these foul <laughs> criminals have disturbed the peace of the empire. Uh, remember chat. 
It's not about what you do, it's about who you know. The Imperial Knights thank you for rescuing Prince Yoder and protecting Princess Esteles. Super sad, but it's true. Please, take this. We've got no need for this. It's not like we did those things for the sake of the Knights. I see. What about Estelle? She has just given her consent to be returned to the Imperial Capital. What? Well, I guess she is a princess after all. The princess is waiting at the inn. We would be pleased if you made an appearance. Hmm. Alexei is a guy's name in this. It's so almost imagining it'd be a girl's name, but I like it. Oh, it's the cook. He's going to give us another recipe. What does he give us? Fish with miso sauce. Cool. I should probably work on these recipes more, but it's kind of an extra thing that I don't really care about. Ginger flexible name? Ooh. I see you next. I see you. That's, yeah. Okay. I was so surprised okay. to find out that Estelle was a princess. I had a feeling. She knew Flynn and she was obviously brought up as a noble. Shut up. You knew already. Maybe. Oh, man. I wonder if I was rude to her without realizing it. Your language has been unpardonable. <laughs> Captain Carroll, the sentence for insulting royalty is... Decapitation. <laughs> been nice knowing <laughs> you. What about you? You're way more rude than I am. Guess it's off with both our heads, then. What? Th that's... Idiots. I love those little cutscenes because they're just like super anime and I and I love them. No, but for the question of the day. So uh, Estelle's going back home, huh? I'm gonna get a second to talk about what I think my answer for the question of the day is. But for now. You don't have a problem with this, Yuri? It's not my decision to make. Well, I guess that's true, but more importantly, where are we? This is the city of Helior. Geographically speaking, it's located between Torum Harbor and the city of Dondrest. I'm glad that Carol just knows exactly, like, where everything is. It was only just recently built. It's still a very new town. Uh, next? No. We got led out of jail and we're trying to figure out where we are now. That's about if it. If you follow this road to the east, you'll hit Kerr Bakram, where we were earlier. Cut through the west and go to the northwest to reach Dondrest. I see. Well, maybe I'll have a look around the town a bit. I've got my own business to attend to. Hmm, what to do? All right, with everybody. Okay, so we're back to just being with us. The rising city of Heliord. Dude, don't do it, Bam. Don't do it. I'm really afraid that you're just gonna go all in. Ooh, well, that's, that's pretty darn close to being all in. A.H., welcome in. How are you doing today? Scoop, how you doing, man? Welcome in. That's why I played it. Okay. So, right now the game just wants me to talk to people and run around. I'm not going to read everything everyone's saying, unless I feel like it's relevant to the overall storyline. Ha! Ah, yeah, Levi. If he wins, this is gonna be huge. Scoop getting in on that raid as well. True, next, he didn't go all in. <laughs> uh, I think, next, I think if you do raid all, I think it does it. Raid all? Oh, dang, that's sad. Okay, Levi confirmed it. Okay. Uh, 